we have created the form now what we are going to do we are going to separate the files i will do control b and inside this main folder i will be creating one file header.php if you want you can create separate folder includes and inside that you can include all this file but as of now i am only going to use header so i have just created one file header inside this header section i will come to index.php this entire header section i am going to copy and inside this i am going to paste and from here i will be removing this i will save this now if i just refresh this one you can see the header section has gone but i want this header section inside my index file so what i will be doing i will be including header so for that i will write one comment include header inside index.php this is the php syntax inside this php i will be writing include and here i will give header.php file name save and this header.php also i am going to save now i will come here i will refresh you can see now header is visible inside index.php we have included header and this is how we are just going to write the php syntax now inside css file i will be pasting the entire css code which i have written so that whatever classes i will add the stylings will be done automatically in the background and i will be stopping the video if you want you can take the screenshots and accordingly you can give the design or else if you are aware of css you can give your own styling because there is no end to giving stylings i will close this now inside the style.css i'm just going to paste the entire css code i will come on top first i have just included font i'll show you how to include the font in my browser i will be searching google font i will open the first link inside this whichever font you want suppose if you want this roberto select this font and here we will be having all the sizes click on any of the style and inside this this font will be added just go to import and just copy this one from import you can copy and you can paste inside css file and after that font family also we will be getting from here i will come here now if you just scroll down you can see i have included poppins for poppins also we will have this font family and for roberto which i have included now for that also i will have this font family just include that here i have created css variables and i have given the default colors which i will be using in this project i have given the font size you can just take the screenshot i am not going to explain the css part because this is completely about php when we go to css part this will almost take 1 hour to complete all the css part in every section so we are not going to focus much on css part without using css only if you want to build the project you can use html and php only here and there you can give some css tidings this is the header header body okay these are the stylings i have given don't worry regarding the css part i will be providing you only with this css file in the comment section and you can just copy the css stylings from there and you can start writing the code along with me okay we have just separated our file and we have included css stylings